How's it going? It's Mike here from the Hudson Valley Foodie, and today I'm going to show you how to humanely kill a lobster. Um, this is the way chefs do it. That's how I learned it. Um, it looks a little medieval and kind of cruel, but it's actually very fast and effective, um, rather than throwing these guys into a pot of hot water, which definitely isn't fun for them. Um, you take a knife, chef's knife, slide this guy over, you know, he flips out afterwards, yeah, he's getting mad. You're going to put it right here, there's a pointy spot right there, and you're going to go down, and you kind of cut his head in half, I know it sounds sick, but you're killing the guy instantly, so, sorry bud, uh, done, see, and like, these things, stuff is still moving, but that's just the reaction of, uh, of, um, reflexes or whatever they call it because I could rip this guy's tail off now and five minutes later you go to touch the tail and it'll still move so you know he's really not feeling anything right now it's just reflexes all right he is dead as a doornail and I'm gonna grill this guy's tails and stuff so let me get his buddy and we'll do it one more time he might start kicking and stuff let me see here All right, bud. It's like good fellas, right? Spider, spider, you ain't you ain't all right, spider. All right, so that's it. That's how you do it. Um, he is dead, and then I will chop his tail off just to show you how I do this stuff. See, it's still moving. He don't feel that. Pull this guy's arms out. Not a very uh, dignifying way to die, but I'm gonna eat him. So, thanks for watching. Hope that helped you out. Stop throwing these guys in boiling water. That's definitely not cool. Um, it definitely hurts, and steaming them alive is not cool either. Um, they definitely feel that too. This they don't feel, or maybe for a second. Thanks for watching. Enjoy.